Welcome all. Today in this session, I'm going to tell you that how you can take the screenshot of a specific web element in Selenium. For that purpose, I have just taken the example of this web page here, or you can apply the same thing on any web application here. So in this page, you can say I have username, password, and a login button. So while running the automation, uh, I want to capture the screenshot of this particular login button. Okay, so we are going to write a code for that. So for that purpose, first of all, let me do one thing. I have already created a Java file and where I'm just writing a code to open a Chrome browser here. So, and the next line, what I have to do, I have to enter the URL of my page. So driver.get and in the get, I'm going to pass the URL of my web page. So let me copy it from here. So this is my page. You, in this case, you can give the URL of your web application, whatever you want, in which application you are doing the automation here. So now here I've given the URL. Now, after that, what you have to do, in your automation, whatever element you want to capture, you have to write the locator for that. Means you have to create a, a web element for that. So I will create a web element for that. So let me right click and uh, let me click on the inspect here. So I will click on inspect and here you will see this is the button. So let me write text path for that. So that will be input. So it is totally depends on you that uh, what type of element or what element you are uh, you want to take the screenshot. So on the basis of that, you can decide your element and you can write the X path. In my case, I'm just taking the example of login. So that's I've created here. So this is my login button uh, locator here. X path is there. Now I will go to here and we'll create a web element uh, reference here. So I'm creating a web element reference here. Uh, like you can say login button. So I'm just giving the name of my reference login button. And now I'm writing driver dot find element, and in the find element I'm just passing by dot x path here, and in the by dot x path I have already created x path, so let me paste it here. So this till now your code is very very simple that you have just opened the browser, you have entered the URL of your application, and then you have created the web element for that. Now after that, how you can take the screenshot of this element? In that case, simply you can do one thing: just use this reference web element reference variable. And you can call a function which is available in this element also get a screenshot as. So in this function get the screenshot as you have to pass a parameter that is called output type. And then you say dot. And here you will choose the option find it because we want to capture the screenshot as a file. So this what this line is going to do for you. This line will take the screenshot of this particular login button only. And then I'm going to store this uh, screenshot in a file reference variable file and I will give the reference variable name src file here. So here you can take the import java.io here. So it will take the screenshot of a login button only. Now I will create a new fresh file, target file. So I'm just creating a new file so that I can copy the content of uh, my screen login button screenshot in this file. So I'm just creating a file here. So let me do one thing here in the constructor. I will give the path. So usually I take the screenshot in my D drive. So I will do one thing. Let me give the path of this one of my D drive and whatever screenshot you want to capture, you can give the name for that. So I can give the name uh, login btn dot png. So what I will do, what it will do, it will take the screenshot of the login button and I store in the SRC file. Then I'm creating a new uh, file with the name of login button dot PNG, uh, which is storing the Pradeep data. So now at last I'm going to use a class that is called files and it contains a function copy file here. So in copy file, I will uh, copy the content of the reference SRC. So this will be my first parameter and my second parameter will be target file. So when I write this code here, you will see I'm going to run this code. So when I run this code, you will see that it will take the screenshot of the login button, only that particular element, and then it will save in the login button dot page. So let me run it. So it's running. So let me complete. Okay. This automation is run and completed here. Now we can go and check uh, my folder here. So here you can see in my folder, if you are able to see, there is a image which is login button dot page. Let me double click on that. So you can see here, it is only capturing the screenshot of the particular element. So in this way, you can take the screenshot of any particular element in your Selenium. 
So now if you like the video, you can click on the like button. If you have any type of query, you can put in the comment box. And if you have not subscribed my channel till now, you can subscribe it. Thank you.